What's up guys? I wanted to talk to you guys a few minutes just about one of my least favorite baits to throw. I know this this sounds kind of sounds kind of funky, but it is. It's a jerk bait and a lot of people don't like to throw jerk baits, but over the years this has become one of my go-to weapons when I'm on the water. This thing has put a lot of money in my pocket, especially coming up through the opens. There was a few situations where this bait was really, really key for me. One of my favorite jerk baits is this uh, McStick by Spro. Mike McClellan designed this. One of the best jerk bait fishermen on the planet. Um, and it's super effective. It's got really erratic side to side action. It's very easy to cast as well. Um, the main thing to remember now, right now, here we are in mid to late winter right now, and jerk baits can be very effective because they're so good at catching lethargic and active fish. It's a good way to get a reaction bite. Now, a couple of things are really key when you're going to tie on a jerk bait like this uh, mixed stick that I have here is uh, number one is your rod. You know, one of my favorite go to's for this bait is a seven foot medium action with a um, um, with, with, with a fast action tip because I really want to, when I hit that bait, I really want that thing to, to have that erratic side to side action on them. So it's a seven foot Legend Extreme by St. Croix. Um, this rod right here is super light, super compact, very well balanced. And um, it, it's hard for me to throw a jerk bait on anything but this rod. And the second thing is your line size. You know, I typically, I'm gonna stay somewhere between 10 and 15 pound fluorocarbon when I'm throwing a jerk bait. You know, I'll go to 10 if I'm in some really clear water where I have to make long pauses and I'll go up to 15 if I'm around some vegetation, you know, something that I really need to, I really need to jerk uh, this bait off of. So make sure your equipment is right on a jerk bait. And if you don't like throwing a jerk bait, guys, this thing can be really effective this time of the year. And you really need to have this thing tied on at all times because I do as well. So I hope this helps everybody. Um, tight lines and tie yourself on a jerk bait.